country in 13 years. We have 14 retired members with between 20 and 37 years of service. Our veterans have fought in World War II, Korea, Vietnam, Desert Storm, and Iraqi Freedom. Honoring veterans has not always been popular. I know as a kid, I remember standing on the side of the road, waving my little flag, watching my uncles, my parents' friends, march in a veterans, or firstly an Armistice Day parade, or a Veterans Day parade. I remember being, as a Cub Scout, being asked to ride in the parade of all these veterans. I remember decorating my bike with blue and red streamers, attaching flags, and for some reason, baseball cards to the spokes of our thing. <laughs> to this day, I hope I didn't use a Jackie Robinson rookie card, <laughs> a Duke Snyder, or Willie Mays. They were a lot of ruined baseball cards. I remember those veterans when I was a kid. They had difficulty fitting into their uniforms. And they marched, as they marched, they didn't march at the speed of when they did, when they served. Back then, love of country, patriotism was a very popular thing. Great generals and admirals, Eisenhower, MacArthur, Nimitz, Halsey, Arnold, they were alive, they were our heroes. Hollywood idols and baseball idols were all veterans. Many of them gave up their careers to serve during the Second World War. And our politicians, most all of them were veterans. But as I said, service and honoring veterans was not always popular. In the 60s and 70s, Korea became the forgotten war. There were no ticker tape parades. Returning veterans from Vietnam were humiliated, spat on, but more importantly, all these veterans who suffered from PTSD and the effects of Agent, Agent Orange were abandoned. But times change in our lives, and things did improve for the celebration of veterans. The Vietnam Memorial, the wall, was opened to honor the 558,200 men and women who had lost their lives in Vietnam. If you remember back in January 1991, you heard that deep voice of James Earl Jones saying, this is CNN. And then we watched the first video, TV War, with smart bombs and stealth fighters. And we had a quick victory and a whole brand new set of heroes. Storm and Norman Schwarzkopf. Colin Powell. In 1995, finally, a memorial to the veterans who served in Korea was opened in Washington. And in 2021, 9-11-2021, patriotism, patriotism, service to the country, and a love of America returned. America had been attacked. Enlistment soared. Flags flew everywhere. But now, 20 years later, the times have changed again. What does it say to the millions of men and women serving today 
when they see pampered athletes kneel during the national anthem, when Hollywood elitists and politicians call this country a racist nation, and nothing is very exceptional. And when we have a government that is considering giving millions of dollars to people who have entered this country illegally, were separated from their families temporarily, while we have thousands of gold star families who have been permanently separated from their loved ones. We have over 60,000 veterans living on the streets each night and many in the forest here in Ocala. We have thousands of catastrophically injured vets who struggle every day of their life. And we have vets dealing with PTSD, which many of them have not been successful. We average over 6,000 veteran suicides a year. As we get older, we kind of look back at our youth. We saw the pictures of us in younger men clothes and younger women's clothes. Each day, I look in the mirror and I look out in the audience and I see those same veterans of our youth with the exception of one or two in this room. I don't think many of us could fit into our uniforms. <laughs> and I know we don't walk or march like we did when we wore those younger men's clothes. Since we have so many new neighbors and several new veterans, and you've seen what we all look like early in life, what I'd like to do is to call the roll of the veterans that are here, and I'd ask them each to stand and be recognized. Major General Donald Wins, Royal Canadian Air Force, retired. <laughs> 